We're here with Assembler and Hat Wearer Extraordinaire. Hat Wearer Extraordinaire is the important part. <laughs> Ladies, right. can you believe he's single? All right, I am here for I a... said, ladies, can you believe he's single? <laughs> okay, Anyways, so what do you got? Okay, um, I am here for a follow-up review of the Orc Battle Wagon Kit. Um, this one has had some conversions on it. As you can obviously see, there's a uh, Def Rolla here. And I, uh, I cut this piece um, with the razor saw and I flipped it around. So it looked more kind of uh -huh. like an orc, orky no, mouth. Normally it's on the bottom. Yeah, right? normally this is poking up. Like a bulldozer. Thing. Yeah, it's like okay. a bulldozer. But I kind of right. cut that, chopped up a little bit, took some uh, sided rhino hatches. Right. And uh, took this uh, cylindrical plastic thing. Right. Good it it seems like on. a pretty easy conversion Yeah, it was to a, do. It was, it was pretty it, simple. Uh, it actually. seems to lend itself to that, mm -hmm. uh, that conversion. Okay, great. And what else? I just just the amount of freaking detail on this thing's amazing. Yeah. I mean, cuz you got everything from uh just all these like little extra plate things you can right. put on. Extra armor. Yeah. Um And it makes like sense little, too, you know. Little grot up here. Oh yeah, that guy's great. There's your grot rigger. And yeah. he's he's in yeah. a little miniature turret. Yeah, he's, he's got like a, uh, eh. heavy stubby. He's got his own big shooter. His own little turret, turret on top yeah. of the turret. That's great. And this uh, orc face on the top is actually a periscope. Yeah, can you turn it so we can see the back of that? Yeah. yeah. That's that's a really neat. Now, does the top of this come off? Did you leave that, or is it glued on? Okay, no, it great. it come off if you want. All right, and there's actually a hollow area inside that makes sense that can yeah. be painted. Yeah. You can see it I mean, through it the back. I mean, it has a lot of detail in there. There. Yeah, I gotta tell you, that is really slick. Okay, anything else? Anything else? How about the uh, extra pieces? Doesn't look like oh, a whole lot of extras. Yeah, I used uh, a lot of the pieces on this because he wanted it to be as big as menacing as possible. Okay, great. Um, looks the base we got here some extra orc arm pieces. Got the uh, zap gun, which you easily make a. Uh, Zap right. gun out of four. right. Uh, they have uh, zap guns as mm -hmm. uh, artillery pieces, mm -hmm. too. So you probably end up. Or you could have the. Uh, that could probably count as a cannon or. Sure. Just sure. Uh, you even. Make I think you're gonna see that a lot. Yeah. 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 Um. Got just some extra armor plates here. Right. Little, just little uh, uh, miscellaneous thing. stuff. Yeah, you know, this plus things. a bane blade and a king size can of tomato soup. And you've got uh, something pretty impressive. Do we, uh, have we never done? No. <laughs> well, we're going to clean out the break room. Maybe we can make some death rollers out of the uh, corroded cans of pepper and, and uh, chicken noodle soup. Yeah, no kidding. All right. Well, that sounds great. That's uh, really awesome. Really Ray. good kid. I like it. All right. Thank you.